All right, here we go. Here's the 50 song list and a an Excel spreadsheet of it. And what you're getting for your five bucks here <clears throat> is a very usable and customizable list that you can cater to your needs. Now, obviously, as I said in the article, that these aren't songs that you necessarily need to play, uh, but they're songs that you should know. But if you were to play them, here's something, or any of these, <clears throat> here's something you can do with this list. You can modify, you can uh, delete songs if you like. But the great thing about this is the way you can organize it. So we have it right here in the order that it is in the article um, by number. And then the title of the song, the artist, then we have the year it was released, the runtime of the song, which is very helpful, the key of the song, very helpful, and the BPM or beats per minute. So what you can do with this list here, since it's in Excel, is change the order. So let's say you want to take some songs out of this list and clump them by key, which makes transitions easier. You would just click on this arrow, click on ascending, and now it's going to organize it by key. So all the songs that are in A, A minor, B, and so on are all clumped together. So you can see what songs are in that key. Um, <clears throat> and that makes it helpful for you to put the set list together to, to make segues smoother. Um, you can also do the same thing for beats per minute. Now, say if you want to put songs together that are relatively close in tempo, you can just click that arrow, put it ascending, and you'll see what tempo each one is. Now, we're going to put it back in order here. Another thing you can do with this list is actually swap out the songs that are in here. So let's say you don't play Don't Stop Believing. You can just put my, my cool song with one too many O's. And then you can enter that and then put in the... the the information here for that song, the artist, the year it was released, if, if that's important to you, the runtime, the key, and the beats per minute. And then put plug in your other songs in here accordingly and just put in this information and then do the same thing. Um, click on that arrow in that column and organize it for yourself. That's it. I did all that work for you so you can use that to your advantage.